Pine Key Project has contributed more than 450000 to education in the TCI over the past six years. And according to Minister of Education, the Honorable Dr. Carlton Mills, they are now donating once again to assist in the rebuilding of schools that were damaged by the hurricanes. Over the years, Pine Key has granted major assistance financially to schools throughout the Turks and Caicos Islands, both public and private. And to date, Pine Key has donated over, since Hurricane Ike and Tropical Storm Hannah, Pine Key has donated over $91,000 to assist our schools in their recovery efforts. Honorable Mills said that this money will be used particularly for the purchasing of materials and supplies lost by the schools. The Turks and Caicos Islands Community College has received $5,000. H.J. Robinson High School, $12,500. Eliza Simons Primary School, $12,000. And Rona Glinton, $5,000. Turks and Caicos National Museum, $9,731. In South Caicos, the Madre Basin High School, $6,500. Iris Stubbs Primary, $7,320. And Saul Key, the Mary Robinson Primary School, will receive $2,500. North Caicos, Raymond Gardner High School, $5,000, Adelaide Amla Primary School, $5,000, C.H. Hubert James Primary School, $8,400. Although not as severely damaged as the other schools throughout the islands, schools in Providenciales, namely the Enoch Capron Primary School and Clement Howell High School, will also receive money. $6,247 and $5,980 respectively. Honorable Mills guarantees that the government will ensure that the schools are properly rebuilt and said that the British government has granted a generous amount of money and a key area of allocation is education. Honorable Mills also stressed that they are not just trying to build school buildings, but build schools with a purpose. For WIV4 News, I'm Tian Thomas.